go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, we're doing good now. <laughs> what do you mean there's people here? Well, that's people, and somebody lost a shoe. <laughs> No, it's nice out. What do you think, guys? Isn't this gorgeous? Beautiful, I do bet. The leaves are starting to change. This is what we call here in Canada Indian summer weather. It is beautiful. You're looking at uh, about 20. Six to twenty seven today. But after today, it's calling for rain, so today might be our last nicest day to be out for a bike ride. have to end up putting pants on for further bike rides likely after this day supposed to drop down guys to uh, in the low 20s out here guys just a couple boats now Vehicle at the house, finally. Look at the red on that one, babe. On that tree ahead. The top is really red. The leaves are amazing, aren't they? The colors. You got all your flowers here. Stay to the right.
Look at Bella go, going over the bridge. She's a real cyclist now, guys. She put a lot of mileage on these bikes. One of the best investments get out and enjoy together, explore different places on our bikes. A few people here at the boat launch. Gorgeous park here, it's very nice. We have the pathway here for the cyclists and then the walking makes it very nice for people and that's where we were having some fun you can watch one of those videos that was lots of fun that day it's friday today right babe it's friday Wow, shocked there's not many people down here. Fire and rescue doing some training. Hang a left and go across the bridge down here, babe. Yeah, hang a left. Yeah. Let's go down there. <laughs> Just take your time. Don't go fast. Go slow. You're doing a great job, babe. And you, you bike really fast and really hard and you jump in the water. <laughs> uh, <laughs> not gonna do that babe isn't it beautiful down here guys look at that eh we're down on the pier here yeah somebody's out uh kayaking isn't that a gorgeous view guys wow is bella gonna make it oh she made it she made it <laughs> around and around we go. Nobody knows where we're going to stop. Oh, don't go in the water. Ah, that would be a good video. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Is your bike wanting to go for a wash? Huh? Was your bike wanting to go for a wash, babe? <laughs> it, kept, it kept going towards the water. Yeah, somebody left their towel, their beach towel. <laughs> that would have made for a good video, you know. <laughs> uh, Bella going for a bike ride in the lake. Well, guys, we had.
It is perfect out, babe. So nice. Not too hot. You find it comfortable? Yeah, it's good. See the city was in here digging out the some of the ditches for drainage. I don't see any homes with sold signs on them, guys. Oh, look at that tree there, babe, the maple. It's kind of orange. Yeah, different color through my Polaroid sunglasses, guys. It's really colorful with my glasses on. It's magnificent. I love autumn. Fall is amazing here. The colors are just spectacular. You never know what you're going to see. And it's the different parts of the tree that's still grand, uh, green. <laughs> Look at that, guys. Look at that tree. That is just beautiful. It's starting to change the leaves. And then all those leaves will fall down. And that's when the hard work starts, guys. Because you got to pick up all those leaves. You don't want to leave those leaves on your grass over winter because it'll suffocate your grass, guys. It'll kill the guys. Isn't that stunning? The tree. So that's a maple, guys. Look at all the different colors of the leaves. Spectacular. Even look at that bush there, guys. That's the same type of one that I, I have at my home. Almost all the trees on my property are maples, but they're different type of maples. They're sugars, silvers. Look at the orange on that maple. The maples, uh, to me, are the most stunning when the leaves change. Still nice flowers out. Flowers are very happy. Not sure if those are clematis or a different type of flower, but they're very happy where they are. Yeah, that house sold back there. That's the only house I've seen uh, with a sold sign on here, babe. Look at that one, guys. There's a clump of red right there. Look at that. And a lot of leaves have already fallen off of that tree, which is a maple. You guys see that uh, airplane away up in the sky there, leaving the jet stream? Not sure if it'll pick it up or not in the video. 
It's so way up there. Ah, lots of color down here, guys. Look at all the color. It's always odd how the trees colors just change in certain areas. Look at that guys. Spectacular. Mother Nature. Oh wow, look at this one down here babe. Look at that tree, it's almost it's fully uh, out. Huh? It's amazing how the different trees, the leaves in that change. Look at that, guys. No red on that one, almost all orange. Oh no, there's some red. The Polaroids give me a different view. But guys, isn't that stunning? The tree. So that's a maple, guys. Look at all the different colors of the leaves. Spectacular. Even look at that bush there, guys. That's the same type of one that I, I have at my home. Almost all the trees on my property are maples, but they're different type of maples. They're sugars, silvers. Look at the orange on that maple. The maples uh, to me are the most stunning when the leaves change. So nice flowers out. Flowers are very happy. Not sure if those are clematis or a different type of flower, but they're very happy where they are. Yeah, that house sold back there. That's the only house I've seen uh, with a sold sign on here, babe. Look at that one guys, there's a clump of red right there. Look at that, and a lot of leaves have already fallen off of that tree, which is a maple. You guys see that uh, airplane away up in the sky there, leaving the jet stream? Not sure if it'll pick it up or not, the video. It's so way up there.
Ah, uh, lots of color down here, guys. Look at all the color. It's always odd how the trees, the colors just change in certain areas. Look at that, guys. Spectacular. Mother Nature. Oh, wow. Look at this one down here, babe. Look at that tree. It's almost it's fully uh, out. Huh? It's amazing how the different trees, the leaves in that change. Look at that, guys. No red on that one, almost all orange. Oh no, there's some red. The Polaroids give me a different view. Seeing through the Polaroid uh, sunglasses. That's why sometimes I think of uh, getting those uh, lenses that you put on your camera that are magnetic for polarized. Problem is I just don't want to carry them around guys and you don't know when you're going to really need them. So I don't know how well they work in the with the sun behind you. And they're not inexpensive. So so far, I'll just stay with what I am, but I'm looking forward to today. We're getting uh, our new uh, action cam. I've been waiting for that to come out for over a year now. And that's the DJI Osmo Action Pro 5. The Canadian flag going into the park. Beautiful, hey eh, guys? Look at all the different colors of the water. One of the things that's going to be nice, guys, is with this camera here, which is uh, the Action 3, which is a great camera, guys, because you can put 4K on it. We've been very happy with it. But night shots, uh, we're doing the videos, uh, not impressed. And when we're doing a lot of things at nighttime, that's one thing that we're not happy about. But also, uh, we'll be able to connect the, the Mic 2s uh, so you won't hear all this wind noise. This one you can't connect mic two mics to it. So, you know, you can do different external, which I've tried, but they just don't seem to work that good. So, and you can do uh, the Pocket 4. Uh, you can only do one mic. So, the Pro 5, you can do two mic twos, which is awesome. Just like we're really enjoying... Uh, the Pocket 3s that we have, even though Bella is not really using hers all that much yet, but she will in time. There's somebody pouring in out their boat. Yeah, so the Osmo Action 3 that I'm using right now, shooting this video in 4K, and most of the videos that you see underwater in a lot of different areas were mostly like we were in a Brockai and the Hole and Secure and Coco Grove. Those were all used with this camera, guys. So it does a great job. But the the Pocket 3 is a game changer, guys. But it's not waterproof. Not even really, I think it's slightly water resistant. But really impressed with the, with, uh, the usage of that. 
but we need something for action for all types of weather so that uh, DJI Pocket or DJI Osmo Action 5 Pro uh, will be a great asset in regards of what we do and what we share with you. But it's gorgeous down here, you guys. You've seen lots of our videos. We never get tired of this uh, bike ride, guys. It's just not a bike ride that we get tired of. So, doing it all the time and enjoying it. Good exercise for us. Gets us out of the house. Bella's doing a lot of lives. I'm supporting your live streams by watching over. She's doing amazing. Look how shallow the water is, guys. The water is basically up to that lady's ankles out there. Did you want to stop anywhere here, babe? Yeah? Dang, huh? Hmm? Oh, God. Yeah, isn't that beautiful, guys? Just swing at the beach with the beautiful view of Lake Simcoe. I don't think you really need to be pushed. But let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, we're doing good now. <laughs> what do you mean there's people here? Well, that's people, and somebody lost a shoe. <laughs> No, it's nice out. What do you think, guys? Isn't this gorgeous? Leaves are changing there. Look at all the leaves across there, guys. Look at them starting to change. It's so soothing. What's the name? That that the uh, that the girl is very nice, babe. What the dinghies? Those are called dinghies, inflatables. Mm -hmm. Yeah. That's so nice. Yeah, but very hard in this type of water. Mm -hmm. That little bit of a wave or. It'll be a challenge for them. Once you get out there, they just float around. It's nice out. Nice clear day. Yeah. 
There's a few people out, guys. Not many. Amazing for a Friday. That's why that people there, uh, you know how to swim because it's a lot the lake. A lot of lakes, that's why they know how to swim? Mm. Well, that's not totally true, babe. A lot of these people may not know how to swim. You don't need to swim to be out going up to your waist in water. Mm. You don't need to know how to swim. Look at that lady over there. She's barely up to her knees. Because the water is very shallow. When it gets blue, where it starts to go blue to the bowies out there that are floating, that's where it drops down and gets deep. Wherever you see the change of the color out there, that's where it's a lot deeper. See the sand? It's all sandy here, babe. The other one, kids, only one. Yeah. Okay, guys, bye for now. Hope you're having a great day. Don't forget to subscribe. Take 10. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you for watching, guys. Make sure to subscribe. What do you have to say, babe? Thank you for watching, guys. Don't forget to subscribe.